What's up, peeps, and welcome back to the Lionel B Show. It's your first time tuning into the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos, man. Also, make sure y'all click that notification bell button so anytime I drop a brand new video, y'all be the first ones to get it. Now, some of y'all, if y'all are not receiving my brand new videos, man, make sure you hold down the bell button and make sure it says all instead of personalized. Now, by now, news has been circling around the internet about Jay-Z's daughter, Letitia Macer. Her face has actually been all over the place, man. Of course, it's been on the Lionel B Show a few days ago and as well as World Star Hip Hop. And she also, I believe, putting out a book, man, about being heir to the throne and, you know, being basically denied by her dad. Now, a lot of people actually went clapping at her on Facebook, man. Now, when they started clapping at her, man, they were saying some real negative things. Now, mind you, she's saying she's not asking for any type of money whatsoever. She just wants to be acknowledged by her dad, Jay, her twin. And the crazy thing is, man, she's got a family member that used to hang out with Jay-Z back in Cambridge. She actually went on Facebook and dropped some major receipts. So I want y'all to make sure y'all tune into the entire thing, man. She's going to be dropping so many receipts that all the naysayers, man, all you got to do is share this video. Y'all check this out. And a lot of comments back and forth about Tisha and about people wanting money and so on and so forth about this situation with Jay. No, listen to me. Way back when me and Jay Z and all us used to hang out, he wasn't even big then. He was bony. Up. He was. <laughs> Look, get nobody. I didn't know he was gonna blow up the way he is. Well, we just used to chill. I don't know nothing about what was gonna happen in his life the way he is now. But the thing of it is, when it comes down to him and my sister and the relationship, yeah, they had a relationship. They used to lay up in my crib constantly. All the time. It's a couple more people in Cambridge that was there. I can't put say their names because I don't know whether they allow me to say things, say, you know, say their name and stuff about but that we all was in the house and stuff together. Um, it was about mm, 13, 14 of them came down out the city from somewhere. I don't know where they came from. New York, Philly, some daggone where. I don't know. Love, Jay-Z, Panama, uh, De Haven. Uh, a, a little bit more. The one that killed the woman and put her in the chair. I don't forgot all of the name. Shit, my 20 year old was nine months old when all of that went down. Aria was 10. Tisha was about eight, a little bit underneath for Aria. So, when uh, um, we tried to contact Rockefeller, because that's I'm the one called, me and Lisa, at my house on Greenwood Avenue in Cambridge, Maryland. I called Rockefeller. I called several places, actually. The last place I called was Rockefeller, and this is what they said to me. The man said, do you know how many people call here a week and say they, they Jay-Z baby dad? They Jay-Z baby daddy? So no. that man, he was slinging ding-a-ling everywhere. Just like when he was in Cambridge, he was slinging ding-a-ling everywhere. But believe it or not, him and um, Lisa had a, had a, they had a relationship. He liked her. They walked up and down the street holding hands and stuff like that. Y'all, y'all, you young people, y'all young bucks don't know nothing about it. I'll be 59 my birthday. 59. Y'all young bucks don't know nothing about it. I know all about it. Him laying up in my crib and everything with my sister. Yes, he did. He had a relationship with her. And as far as Tisha, wanting him, wanting him to know about money, nothing, nothing of the sort. It was all about the respect for her dad. The man that raised her, which I'm not going to call his name either, out of his respect, because that's what it was back then. It was respect for, for her father, her father, the, the man that raised her. So didn't nobody want to start problems and get shit going. It's a whole lot of y'all asses on your cheated on your <laughs> man back in the day. <laughs> y'all were laying up with them that came down here. Half of y'all girls in Cambridge was laying up with those boys. Now, I can't remember Well, I laid up with one or two of them. I don't hey, even yo, know. Mom, I up. can't remember, so I ain't gonna <laughs> lie. Because it's been over 20 years ago. But a whole lot of y'all gals in Cambridge laid up with those boys. You might not laid up with Jay-Z, but Lisa did. And whoever else laid up with my t My cousin Tony laid up with him. He asked Tony to marry him, but Tony didn't marry him. Tony went with William Annals. I mean, what's his name? Uh, 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 Chill. Vanessa Lewis' brother. That's who Tony was in love with. Because he messed with Tony Lewis. I mean, Tony. I mean, Tony Annals, too, my cousin. Yeah, he did. He asked her to marry him. Like I'm telling you, he asked her to marry him. And she did not. Okay. And when it comes down to, again, us waiting. If we didn't wait. We tried. Teach was about six or seven years old. Like I'm telling you, six or seven. We were ordinary people. What were we supposed to do? 
When the man said, do you know how many people call here and say Jay-Z their baby daddy? We left it alone. He said, I suggest y'all get a lawyer. That's exactly what he said to me on the phone. Lisa was sitting in my house. I don't understand why the people that don't know about what went on in Camus gets on Facebook and talk all of that shit. Y'all don't know what happened. You don't got no business calling her names or saying none of that stuff. Because really what I'm sitting here telling you is the Aunt truth. Lisa got MS a it's couple the years truth. ago. She, they uh, keep Lisa, saying... What? Why would he mess with somebody who was sick like that? He didn't mess. Well, and back she then when, when um he was dating Lisa, Lisa was not sick. Lisa was young and vibrant, beautiful, just like she is now. She just has MS now. That's it. But far as all the other stuff that people talking and calling that girl names and saying she want money, it ain't nothing about no money. Oh, y'all the ones that the ones that sitting there talking, y'all jealous, y'all haters. Y'all wish y'all had didn't want to get some money, but it ain't even about that because she ain't even after that. She's not even after no money. Her mom's sick. She want to know who her family is, who her dad is. You understand what I'm saying? And no, her she mom knows. didn't let her know back in the day. Just like I'm saying to y'all. Y'all f***ed on your man too. And you know you're dead. Y'all f*** those dudes that came down. They was from house to house. Don't ain't no need in lying about it. Because I know some of you that did it was f***ing. Because yes, you was. And you probably half of, some of y'all done put babies on these dudes in came. That's not those baby daddies. They're those guys from up there that came down there with them boys. No shit now. Y'all want me talking about other people. Y'all don't you can't talk about other people. You talk about yourselves, what y'all done now. A lot of y'all done too. Yeah, she had a boyfriend, which was this young this man that stepped up to be um teacher's dad, stepped up to the plate to be the man, but to be her father, but Y'all done the same thing. Y'all was out there messing around with those boys too. You just didn't lay up with Jay-Z. She just happened to get out pregnant by him. And, all and now it's coming out and you're hating. That's all it is. That's all it is. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't nothing she else. Ain't because for though. real, for real, for real, if any of y'all, you really want to know who your baby daddy is, some of you should go right now and try to find out really who your baby, <laughs> who your baby dads is and who your real dads are. That's what a lot of y'all should do too. In that case, because for real, I mean, we, they, so a lot of people living lives, living living lives in Cambridge. When it comes down to who your mm -hmm. daddy is, and who your daddy is, if they want to get down to it. Yeah, mm-hmm, yeah, <laughs> yeah, mm-hmm, yeah. I got Mom. two kids, Ariel and Cambridge. Toby, one of them daddy. Yeah, Toby, one of them daddy, and Cardi, one of them daddy. I know who my kid's father is. Yeah, I do. And Lisa knew back then, too. I ain't, I ain't talking about y'all and saying shit. She knew it was Jay-Z back then. We tried. Everybody was saying she didn't try. Oh, we tried. Oh, yeah, we tried. We tried. But we were just ordinary people, just like we just ordinary people right now. We ordinary people. And it came out. It came out. It came out. And now, thing, if a tried. lot of all of that them game and the no shit DNA that went down back in the day came out in Cambridge, a lot of people be in trouble. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And then, you know, back then, it wasn't easy to just step up and get a DNS, D, DNA test by a star. It's not easy today to do that. You got to go through all kinds of channels. And when you ain't got no money, what you supposed to do? I mean, it is what it is. But I'm just saying, far as people calling her names and saying stuff about her mom and stuff like that, Lisa worked all her life real hard. Worked all her life. Tisha, you never try to ask for nothing. Nothing from that man. Lisa never tried to ask the thing of it when when we tried to let Jay know. And but I'm gonna let y'all know. Jay already knew. He already knew. He already knew that that child existed. He just chose not to come about it. He just chose not to deal with her because another man has stepped up to the plate. Which a lot of men doing right now. So y'all can't sit up there and talk about that girl because you am gonna say, oh, she didn't know who her baby real. Yes, she did. She just let another man raise the child, because just like a lot of y'all doing now. Cause the ones, a lot of y'all that got babies on, got put babies on board. Them not them boys' babies, not them boys' babies. They raising somebody else. Hey, know what it. you say? Lisa was always a hard work. Yes, always. She always worked hard. I, and I just came on you, cause you know what y'all. The whole thing about the situation, I don't give a, I, I do give a f, but I don't give a f. And with some chicks in Salisbury said, why I put the Lord in it. Number one, the reason why I put the Lord in it is because we are God's children. <laughs> she is God's child. Hey, 
I ain't saying I'm perfect. I ain't saying none of that. But I'm going to always put God first. They can say what they want about Terry Turner. They can say what they want about me being a devil. I'm not a devil, honey. I ain't never messed with nobody's husband. I ain't never bear false witness against my neighbor. I ain't never been a troublemaker. I ain't never like that. That's why a lot of people never like me. Because I spoke my mind and told sh and they didn't like it. Oh, well. Oh, mother well. But this is why I'm pissed off about the situation now because my saying what didn't happen. I know what happened. I know what happened with Lisa and Jay-Z. Because he asked me who she was. I the one hooked his ass up with her. Because DeHaven was trying to talk to my sister, Willie Jean. And then all that drug game was going on. If the people really know, know the drug game. See, my brother-in-law was a motherfucking kingpin. Y'all might not know which is Jamar Daddy. King motherfucking pin went to <laughs> federal penitentiary no. for a long time. But well, we're not even going to get up in all of that shit. Because mother set up mother way back like they was talking. Oh, that sh went down. Oh, that sh went down. Y'all just don't know what happened. Y'all just don't know what happened. I know what happened. What is that? That's the only reason why I came up on you. And I ain't. Do anybody got some and, questions? And, 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 and I'm not putting her. Nobody's names was the, in the cribs with us or none of that shit. They, they know probably, who it was. They probably. They know who it was. They know who they was, and I ain't putting her nobody's name. I ain't doing none of that shit. All I'm going to say is they know who they was laying up in there with her. Now, like I said, I didn't know Big Boy. I didn't know Jay-Z was going to blow up like he did. He was, he was tall, slinky as a motherfucker, nappy head. He didn't talk much. We sat back and just chill. He ate. We would, he would cook, go buy food. We cook. We did everything. I mean, got his ass beat a few times, you know, because, you know, like, I mean, that's what happened. You know what I mean? He wasn't no bad person and shit. It was just like... But I can say when it come down to Tisha, he knew. He knew. He knew. He knew the whole nine yards about Tisha. He just, and ugly as hell, somebody said. And he just didn't choose to step up to the plate because another person maybe did it. That Not saying that he didn't want to, y'all. Because maybe, maybe, you know, he just know. didn't want to. I don't know why the hell he didn't. What's the name? I don't know. You know, but I mean, she got a right to know every know what's going on now because he her daddy. He her daddy. It's a ride the hell out of my bed. Ride the. <laughs> yeah, I used to be on the chair. Yeah, Lisa didn't even live in town then. She would come in town, and the reason why they was at my crib, she didn't live in Cambridge then. She lived up in East New Market, and used to come in town, come in town to the crib. See. To my crib. That's how it all went down in the crib. Hear me? Hear me? Okay. That's how all that went down. In the crib. Now, if anybody else wanted to know anything else, all they got to do is ask. Ain't nobody going to lie on the brother. Ain't nobody going to lie on the brother. But I do know one for one thing for sure that brother knew. Brother, The brother knew that Tisha existed. He just chose not to take care of her. And he chose not to ask about her and shit like that. And back to DeHaven. DeHaven knew and knew because I believe he asked DeHaven about it. And if the, if the truth be told, if the truth be told, I don't know. He'll tell the truth. DeHaven will tell the truth. whether, Because DeHaven told us that he's done talked to the whole motherfucking family. DeHaven, if you're honest, Joe did. You told us you done talked to the whole family because me and Lisa talked to your ass about it too years, years, years ago. Yes, you told us that the family knew. Yes, you did. You said the family knew and it was his, 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 I, I, I could have swore you said his aunt, his sister, some damn body. Somebody you used to call that person's name all the time. I forgot you was close to that person. You were close to that family member of Jay. And when I, I believe you took that child with you one time when you went to went to went to Philly or something and took Tisha to meet them people. I really believe you did. I can't remember. It's been it's been so damn long ago. But I'm letting y'all know. Jay Z knew Bert Tisha. Hell yeah, he knew. I am speaking the truth. I'm just saying people was calling my calling my sister names and calling my sitting my niece. And saying that she just wanted money from Jay-Z. But like I'm telling y'all. When they was all laying up back in the day. Jay-Z wasn't blowed up like then. He only had one f longer. And it was called Hawaiian Silky. And hey. <laughs> I had never heard the mother song. Until the mother told me. You know who that is? You know. I said no the f I don't know who you is it. I don't know nothing about no Hawaiian Silky. Because I didn't listen to that shit. And to the day y'all hear my hand to God. 
Hear my hand of God. I still ain't never heard a Hawaiian silky or heard the damn song straight from the door. And that's what I'm trying to tell you. So I never knew the brother was going to blow up the way they is. So that's why I need for people to know it wasn't about that. That girl loved her daddy. That daddy that who her mama was with, who her mama cheated on at the time. Like I said, a lot of y'all cheating on your man now and you're cheating on him back then. So stop with that boy. Cause you might them put them babies on your man that ain't that baby laying up in that crib saying that's your that man baby and ain't that man baby it that motherfucker you done cheated with on that man that man just don't even know your motherfucker cheated okay Mom. and I think homeboy back in the day knew he I I know he knew that that baby wasn't his cause of the color he blacker than the mother and look how red she is her mama red my mama real black though and I'm red though. That's because my grandma Indian too. Mom. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm. Go but ahead. anyway, he took her as his and took care of her. That's a real ass man. You hear me? And never brung it up. Never said nothing. I swear on my mom. I've never heard nothing that boy ever said to saying that baby ain't his. That one that took on being her father. I've never heard him, him or nobody in the street, nor her sisters and brothers that call, you know, that's his, his her siblings. I never heard. Um, that them say that's not my sister or nothing like that. So let me let you know that's a, that's a one hundred fact person. There, that those people are great people. That's why nobody wanted to interrupt their family and say no shit like that to get shit going. You know, some y'all mother that are messier than a motherfucker. Y'all like the as the world turned. Y'all like them soap operas and shit. See, I ain't that type of person. I don't like the soap operas. I don't want to start trouble and shit. I'd rather be humble with people than start trouble with people. You know what I mean? So then that would have been a lot of trouble. You understand what I'm saying? But like I said, we did, we did try to let homeboy know, and that's what happened. You understand what I'm saying? To let all the know, cause to let to to what keep all to the that? trouble down. That's exactly what we did. We tried to let him know. He didn't find her, and we left it alone, you know. And maybe, maybe we should have um, 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 pushed it a little further. But like I said, the man said, do you know how many people call here and say, Jay-Z, their baby daddy? He said, I, uh, the only thing I can tell y'all to do is get a lawyer. That's exactly what he said. Well, like I said, we ordinary people. We don't have no money for the lawyer. Well, I mean, we were ordinary people. Who going to kick her money like that for a lawyer and go through all of that? I mean, hey, we just didn't do it. So it, 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 that's why it's where it is now. You understand what I'm saying? So I just came on here to just let you, let y'all know that it wasn't about the money and stuff like that. And yes, she, and, that's, and, her and, and, that's her dad. He, her dad, he knew, he knew. I know he knew. Got a picture of him holding her. I knew he knew. He just he he just didn't step up, you know. Like, I mean, a lot of people ain't gonna, a lot of people just don't step up. You understand what I'm saying? But he he knew, and I I I know that he knew. I know that he knew because he asked her too. He asked that girl's mom about um this child, and was that his baby and shit. He knew. He knew he was the daddy. You know so. All the other stuff, and I don't got nothing bad to say about him because it could have been another reason why he didn't step up and do what he was supposed to do. I don't know. And it could have been because my sister Lisa didn't push the situation any further. I don't know, but that's not my say. You know what I'm saying? I can't. And, you know, I left it alone. After a while, after that child probably got birth 10 or 11, and I remember some girls over in Salisbury I went to beauty school with. I used to tell a lot of people back in the day, a lot of people back in the day, that Jay was that girl's daddy. But you know what bitch used to say? She lying. She lying. And mother, <laughs> if you think I'm going to sit down and beat it in your goddamn head, you're lying. You're lying. Some of them that came on there and said that sh um. Yesterday and the day before, I told y'all when I was in beauty school with your Delmar Beauty Academy in Salisbury, Maryland. I was in beauty academy with Nisha Dawkins, Danielle Dawkins, all of them. Ask them girls. I used to tell them girls all the time, Bert J being that girl's daddy. I used to tell a whole lot of motherfuckers. No, y'all just chose not to believe it and won't call a motherfucker a liar. But who's a liar? Who liar? When it come out, then y'all gonna see. But stop being haters and shit. It is what it is. I mean, I mean, it is what it is. If he wanted to sling dingy with you, he would have slung dingy with you. 
I mean, it is what it is. <laughs> Don't get on there and be calling the girl names and shit. That girl didn't even know nothing about her mama laying up with Jay-Z. Because she hadn't even existed. And I just didn't like people getting on there calling her bitch shit. Bitches. You think Jay-Z your son's father too? Um, Jay Warner. Jay, you crazy. You crazy shit. <laughs> you crazy shit, Jay. <laughs> I mean, I mean, you crazy shit. Uh, yeah, Jay Warner, you crazy. That's my husband's um, people. That was my in-law. Ain't nobody asking that. But ain't nobody asking no like questions. So, but, but they was talking all that shit on Facebook to me yesterday about what was going on with Jay-Z and all of that. But ain't nobody asking no questions now. But they want Pop Slick and run their mother. Mouth and they wasn't in the mattress, the bed, the sheets, the pillows, what none of it. What y'all what none of it. He your daddy till Freddy, uh uh whatever your name is, okay. He can be your daddy. Chrissy, cousin, cousin. And I like how you told that dude off was calling her all kinds of names last night and saying that mess. She said she is a hard working girl and going to school and stuff. And that's the only reason why I got on here. Because other than that, I wouldn't do it. I'm too grown and sexy for this. I wouldn't give a f what now one of them thought her there for real. I'm too grown and sexy for it. But I'm doing it for Tisha. You understand what I'm saying? And then when I seen Jonathan Moloch. You know, come out with his last night and knowing about that. And he said, okay, Terry Turner, she a replica person, you know, and, and knew what I was talking about. Tell them, come on, you tell this damn right. I know what I was talking about. I was right there. I might not have been in the bed, the sheets and the pillow were in the motherfucking bedroom, but they was in that And I heard the motherfucking movement. I heard all of it. He wasn't coming for, he wasn't coming over that motherfucking eating and for nothing. He was Okay. I wasn't in the bedroom. I don't, I wasn't in the bedroom. But I'm letting you know uh, what they were doing in the bedroom, okay? All right. And whoever else he called himself laying with and whatever, Noah, he never, hey, when he stayed over my crib, he stayed, he got up, they left the next day and went on so on and so forth. You understand me? That's how it went down. Just like any other people, y'all not slow. Y'all ain't slow. Y'all go on Monday night, Tuesday night, Wednesday night, whatever night you go out. They know what they you, do. you already know what you do. Y'all already know what you do. And like I said, go right back to y'all cheating on your man. A whole lot of you cheating on the man or chair. And you got men. You're cheating behind your man's back. So that was the case that what happened right there. And see, it's a lesson to be learned. See, look where we're at now. With all of that shit that's going on. It I like a lie, though. It, 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 uh, uh, it, 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 it's crazy because it's, it's real crazy. And you know what, y'all? This is this another question I, I was sitting in the back thinking about. If this mother came as y'all wouldn't be on your going through all this, would you? You wouldn't give a while if she was trying to come at your look, get her, uh, see where her daddy. Y'all wouldn't give a For real, though. For real, though. You wouldn't care. I could go, go back on in my own, in my own, I could go back in my own, in my, in my own life, birth that daddy situation shit. My, I, I, I'm going through that mother shit, but I ain't go, I ain't even gonna go there on Facebook. I ain't even gonna go there on Facebook. But people go through shit hard with that mother, that father shit, okay? I'm, we not even gonna go there. Cause I've been there with my, myself. I'm 59 years old. 59 and was told one thing is another thing. You understand what I'm saying? So mother can't, 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 can't be doing that type of thing they doing when they want to be trying to talk to people because they lay up with somebody and, and, and a baby got created and 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 it, it happened. It happened. A whole lot of people cheat on people and babies get created and then they take it out on them babies and shit. Y'all can't do that type of shit. I mean, it, you can't do that type of shit. It's, just, it's not right. I mean, no. It's not right. And that girl got a right to know. She has a right to know. And whatever go on between her and her mom, far as the whole situation, her mom got to explain to her about what she what she did and stuff, you know. And I mean, a lot. I mean, uh, the people did it. A lot of people did it. And you 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 can't call her. You can't call her. You can't. No, you can't, you, you can't call a person nasty. Y'all can't. Uh uh. I ain't gonna. I ain't. Uh, that's anybody that I say cheat. I call cheat. I set up. They set up and cheat. Now, if you married, that's something different. Motherfucker, you ain't got no business out there cheating on your mother. 
husband. But if you got a boyfriend still, you still ain't got no Benny Dirt there. But it is what it is. People do it. 